What's up my Toxic Gamers? Today we're gonna be checking out all the best unrealistic games. We know that gameplays nowadays aren't that exciting. Games aren't that exciting. But trailers are very exciting. Let's check out these upcoming games. This is a series on the channel. If you wanna see more, David, like the video. Turn on the light? Wait, let me try the receiver. And the first game what is called Level like? Zero. I'll take that. We'll go I think it's a space game. Kit. Be careful. I found a broken generator. Repairing now. Good. One more left. Okay, so EMP, somebody's watching them. Yeah, yeah. Man, after the day before, I'm not sure, guys. Like, are you gonna be. <laughs> are you gonna get excited for these games or not? Or, or I, I heard I that I some of them something. are really, really Little good. Let's go to Sector B. 1673. Nice job, Nick. Oh, ow. Ah! Yeah! oh, you got multiplayer as well? Oh, damn. Yeah, I remember David, seeing this. What's going on there? So space horror game, right? How David. many of you are into space games? Damn. Nick and Sharon are dead. Shit. Shit. We have to restore the power now. Grab the car to Sector C. Oh, uh, rip bozo, rip bozo. Yeah, hopefully it's not Go. gonna turn out to be the, okay. the day before. I'll see you at the gate. Because whatever the day before devs taught me is that it's easy to scam the gamers. Bruh. I'm sorry guys, but but that's how it is, right? Like, uh, just don't pre-order games. Don't buy the games day one, okay? You can buy the game on the second day. Bruh. On the second day. Because on the first day, you're at least gonna see like everyone's reaction. You're gonna be able to see the reviews, see your favorite YouTubers or your, I mean, not so favorite YouTubers play, right? Bruh. Or something. And you're gonna find out whether it's worth your money or not because i would like to believe that you guys are working hard for your money so this is why i don't give buy games no more day one bruh only very few oh, if i want to stream then i would but otherwise i won't but this is looking good actually yeah Roger that. Run. David, I found the repair kit. Yo, oh, it, your dog, it reminds me of Call of Duty Ghost Extension, actually. Sean, be careful. They're coming from your direction. Oh, damn. Oh, shit, David. I hear them. Damn. One, six, seven, three. Hold on, just a little longer. I'm living in the gates. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, it's oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of the. Uh, kind of reminds me of. Not kind of. It dead ass reminds me of Call of Duty Ghost. Okay, so what's this called? Tournament round one, Las Vegas. I. Yeah, it's that game. It's it's now it's now out. It's now released. The finals. Okay, what's coming after this one? What's coming after this one? How many of you are actually playing this? I haven't had that much time to play, to be honest. I personally, uh, I've played like two, three games and so far I'm trying to adjust to the movement. I need to find time to play this. Because this is, uh, this game is being made by the Battlefield devs and if you guys didn't know, the next Battlefield game has also been teased. Yay, it has been teased. And I've also made a video on the channel already for it. Like, those of you that have not seen it, definitely check it out. They're uh, teasing the next level destruction. Bruh. They're saying the next game is going to have crazy amount of destruction. They say that every single time. But this game destruction is insane uh, to me. It, it looks good. Looks insane as well. But I have to, to guess that next Battlefield game is going to be a banger. It has to be. Otherwise, it's like over for Battlefield. It, it needs to be. It needs to be successful and they say that they're gonna have the campaign as well. But but it's crazy that some of these Battlefield devs that left, some of them worked on this game, made like an FPS shooter like this. It has the vibe of Fortnite, but, uh, but it's kind of different, right? Like it's different from Fortnite. It feels realistic, but also fun. It's like Fortnite, but like on steroids with the FPS. That's how I view this game. We got the next game. Let's see which one it is. I've dreamt of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hellblade, Hellblade, Hellblade. 
It's a new one, right? New reveal? Fear and fury. Do you hear it? The heartbeat of the lost ones. What if you're cop into if not? WL? Did you get erectile dysfunction after watching this or Bruh. or or you hit in the G spot? Let me know, Wayne. Ninja Theory. Music kinda good. Music kinda good, but They need to show more gameplay, honestly. Like actual level, you know? Like demo. Until the very last beat. Because this is more like a cinematic shot. Nothing wrong with it, it's actually good. But it doesn't hype me, man. The the original reveal hyped me up even more. Okay, well, I spoke too soon. <laughs> this is the gameplay, I guess this is the gameplay. But you know what I mean, right? Like, I don't want to see, like, cut a uh, trailer like that. I want to see an actual demo gameplay. Like, five minute, five, I'm not even asking for ten no more. Okay, give me, like, a five minute walkthrough gameplay where we see the gameplay, you know, just walking around, interacting with the world, uh, no cuts, you know, that type of gameplay. I feel like that, that's going to hype people up even more. Agree? Disagree? Like if you agree. Subscribe if you agree. Like and subscribe if you agree. Does that strategy work, guys? Bruh. Let me know, because I, I saw a comment from one of you who said that, bro, every time you say something, I agree, and then you quickly after say, like and subscribe if you agree, and I'm like, damn, bro, now I gotta like and subscribe, because I agree. If that is effective, like and subscribe. Bruh. Now, man, I appreciate all of you guys watching, man. Thank you all, man. Oh, damn. Oh, my God, bro. What will I become? Uh, just don't change your gender. That's all you ask, bro. Like, you don't need it. What will I become? Just don't change your gender. Get more, okay? Senua Saga Hellblade 2 2024 Game Pass Xbox uh, Series X and Xbox... Uh, <laughs> Xbox... Uh, oh, sh oh, my God. This is called Project Root. Oh man, this is gonna be a weed game. Yo, GTA 9 looking good. And yo, hey, whoa. Yo, I gotta talk about this real quick. Guys, 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 guys. Recently, that GTA 5 source code leak out, right? Alongside that, we had GTA 6 leaks. We had other leaks as well. And within the source code, we found out that Rockstar, at one point, they were working on GTA Tokyo game. Oh, shit. I, I should have that video out already on the channel. It is absolutely crazy to me that we could have seen a Tokyo game. And this, I don't think it's in Tokyo, but it kind of reminded me of that. I think it's in Japan somewhere. Or what if it's actually in Tokyo, right? But the graphics aren't that... I think it's Tokyo. Man... Like, bro, what the... It's like Minecraft... <laughs> like, Minecraft character. Graphics aren't, like, end-all, be-all, but I, f I wish that the, the character that was walking around was actually, uh... A real-looking character. I'm only at 5% audio, and it's this loud? Holy... Holy! Next! Uh, okay, honestly, the city is looking good. But th this character, like, just breaks immersion. If we had, like, a real uh, character walking, because... Look at this. The world feels real. It feels realistic. The graphics aren't insane, but they aren't bad either, especially at nighttime. They're looking good. So why don't we have a real uh, character or a real-looking character? Why we have that? I think this is a missed opportunity. Because the world is looking very good. Or maybe I'm not understanding the concept. Maybe I'm... Yeah, maybe that's what it is. Maybe I'm not understanding the concept. If you do, let me know in the comments. This is black metal. Yet fame still holds sway. Their glory fades through time. Okay. In tunes of somber gray. Oh damn. You what you had to make that noise, bro? Like you distracted me, bro. Now my painting all ruined. And is it true that this is it true that this game is being made by like one dev? More good. Of course. 
then why is there always suffering? Yeah. Why do the bad folks always win? Yeah. Because goodness without teeth punishes not. Yo, I don't even it know, like... Foments. Those fingers were swell, bro. Like, imagine, like, you trying to, like, hype up your, your chick, right? With those fingers, bro. Right? Like, I swear to God. Like, imagine, like, you know, hyping up your chick with those fingers. <laughs> with those fingers. She would be like, don't. Uh, <laughs> I don't like those fingers. I don't like this. The keeper of the new west. Welcome the destiny. I started love. The destiny. I gotta repent now, man. That was around what I said. What he's destined for. Those old rascals. They surely know how to. Game has that Elden Ring and God of War kind of vibe. Is my kind destined for extermination? Lord, in a good way. Not destiny. So this is the face of the destined one. It will fit me just as well. Yo. In blood yet preaching peace. Yo, I'm not sure if this is being made by one dev or multiple. I, I believe it's being what bit I think it's being made by one dev, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong. If it's being made by one dev, then holy. <laughs> yeah, massive God of War wives. Yeah, exactly, right? Exactly, that gives me that snake wife from 2018 God of War. Black Myth Sweet Wukong. Destiny. Okay, what's next? What's next? What ne what's next? August 20... 2024. Hmm, August 20, 2024. By that time, we're probably gonna have the next GTA trailer, I hope. Bruh. Uh, hopefully, hopefully. So this is the stalker to- Oh my god, yeah! Whatever happened to that? Yeah, because of the actual conflict between- We heard that this game was paused. Okay, I don't remember seeing this. What? Dog. You asked me about my good luck charm. Remember? It's an empty shop. Decided to play soldier. Okay, is it me, me or? Dimitri and I were just discussing a certain puzzle. We found in the zone. But we can't quite seem to get all the pieces to fit. Maybe you can figure it out. Okay, I don't remember seeing this. I think this is new to me right now. It reminded me that we used to be puppets. Holy. Yo, Black one. Ops. Oh my god, this gives me Black Ops 1 vibe, bro. Oh, oh, Yo, like the video if you get that Black Ops 1 vibe. Main menu, right? I'm sorry, Strider. <laughs> Damn. That was the day the sea fields were turned off. Suddenly. Okay, I like it, I like gone. it, I like it. I felt as if I was awakening from a years long coma. And through the scope, oh, damn. we saw the body of an unknown soldier fall. We had a simple choice. Sit back. Man, I cannot be the only one. This gives me like the Pentagon vibes from Black Ops 1 mission. You know, when we go to Pentagon in Black Ops 1, yo, a whole lot of similarities, especially when he picks up the sniper as well. The Dragunov. <sighs> Unlike you. Oh, damn. Oh, what happened, bro? What did I do, bro? What did I do? Okay. All right. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Bruh, what am I going to do with that, bro? Can a brother get like a Bitcoin or two Bitcoin there? You know what I'm saying? Bruh. Can I get Can I get two likes on the video, guys? Uh, Stalker 2 Heart of Chernobyl. Yeah, I think this game... Oh, Q1? What? Q1 2024? Nah, bruh, I wasn't expecting that fast, though. I mean, it was supposed to already be out, I think, but they paused the game because of the actual conflict between Russia and Ukraine, right? And now it's deadass coming on. Okay, what game is that? What game is that? What game is that? What game is that? Game is that? Final Beautiful Infinity. Light? Yeah, that looking good. Okay, that looking good. Just don't stand me, though, like the day before devs. What? Harry Potter? An anthem of heroes. Oh my god. And tears. Yo, those things in underwater reminded me of uh when the daylight pierced do, uh, Harry branches. Potter. We understood. We were standing before God. 
god. Man, oh yo, okay, I like the like the I like the CG here, Kaji. Oh damn. I think they are visiting different planets. Kinda gives me that interstellar vibe as well when you know they, they go on a different planet where time passes differently. Yeah, I think it's like a paranormal game. But holy And here you are. Multiple dimensions, paranormal on type the game, edge I think. Of the creator. Listening to the echoes. Okay, 1982. Our story. What's the name? Beautiful See? Light. Okay. Yeah, okay, honestly, it does look good. It does. Uh, I am intrigued by the idea. You kind of gives me the Venom vibe too. 2025 Geneva. And while you stand in the midst of nothingness, searching for light in the darkness. Yeah, I think it's an alien invasion movie. Oh, not movie, I mean game. Bruh. Okay, I don't remember seeing this, I think. Yeah, we're seeing some new trailers. Behind the high ramparts. Where it cannot see us, we recite our final words. Phoenix 2036. Motherland. Bless your children who are about to die. Beyond my sword and behind my shield, I smile. Because against all odds, oh, I got hiccups. I will triumph. Yeah, okay, honestly, it does look uh does look good. It got a little bit of that Call of Duty campaign aspect style. It has horror vibes, paranormal vibes, multiple realities, dimension, I mean, alien invasion kind of vibe as well. This game is all over the play place, bruh. Was that the Papoosh? The PPSH? It was the Papoosh! I think it was the Papoosh. Was it the Papoosh? I don't know, man. I call it Papoosh. The Papoosh. Uh, shout out to those of you that were around uh, the channel when we had Black Ops 3 Zombies. I think he lost all hope. Man, I really miss the actual, like, realistic soldier camouflage and the real appearance. Something that we used to have in Battlefield games and Call of Duty games back in the days. I remember, like, Battlefield 3 would have, like, real factions, uh, real-looking uh, soldiers with their uniforms. And that definitely multiplied the the immersion. I cannot be the only one, right, that, that feel this way, too. But nowadays, it's, like, the specialist and... They don't even hit the same no more. Like it don't even feel the uh, the microtrans. Uh, uh, they're doing it because of microtransactions. And now we got the Metal Gear. Oh my God! Yeah, the graph. We get it. The graphics are gonna be lit. We get it. The mud is uh, very much uh, on it. We get it. Pow! So. When is that game coming out? I, I think they're gonna announce it. I never actually played Metal Gear games. I, I I know, I know. It sound like you're probably like, hey, you'll skizzle. What? Bruh. Yeah, just never really played it. I, I know this is uh, some of your guys' favorite franchise. God, <laughs> we got frogs in this suga as well. Maybe I'll cop. Maybe I'll cop this. But I want to know, is it like a remake or is it a new game? I, technically a remake is a new game but based on like the original game remaster is like old game but i think it's a new game i hope it's a new completely new game and not just a remake metal gear solid snake eater unreal engine 5 yeah unreal engine 5 part of me i like unreal engine 5 but but when every game has unreal engine 5 it starts to look the same yo yo whoa did that look good gray zone Yo, I, I believe Level Cap made a video on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I saw it. Uh, yeah, it's that game. It's that game. Damn. 
bro. This looks way more like Battlefield. It has that PUBG kind of Warzone vibe. Yeah, homie eating, homie munching right now. <laughs> homie be munching there. Damn. Yeah, this kind of gives me that, you know, when you do mission with uh, Franklin or Lamar, Franklin hops on, hops on in, in the very beginning of GTA 5. Franklin Lamar, yeah. You can check the bullets as well. I think it's Milsom. Just ultra real, realistic. Yeah, there's a fan base. There's a massive fan base for games like that. I did like the graphics. I do like the graphics, the gunplay. Uh, I haven't seen the ga gunplay. I should say brown. That Bruh. I haven't. We haven't seen that much. But I like the guns. The the way you uh, hold them. So. Yeah. No. Nah. Now we got a beep game. Yeah. Whatever happened to that dog we <laughs> dog we gave though? Zoe. It is Zoe. If that wasn't enough cringe for you, I don't know what would be then. In Zoe. Okay, I did see like its trailer, but I think they about to show us like the entire gameplay. Damn. Yeah, okay, seeing this and... Man, I don't know why, but I'm pretty sure like... Don't uh, you guys are thinking the same way I'm thinking right? I don't even have to hide it You guys are hiding, but when I look at it like I get reminded of all the Buddhas that we saw in GTA 6 Bruh. Right, and they were so big and in this one. It's kind of normal normal ish size I feel like that like the the West infatuation with the BBLs especially like the the, the modern woman Infatuation with the BBLs is just insane. Y'all don't need the BBLs bro Like seriously y'all don't need it man not every man want to see the BBLs, bro. Come on, man. I know some of you want to see it. I mean, it... Like, see, like, all of that is kind of normal size. And a lot of you want to say it, but you're too scared to say it, right? I'm not that afraid to say it. I'm just trying to keep a buck 50 here. Like, a lot of the, the, the modern-day women are getting brainwashed and thinking, like, they need a... <laughs> they need a BBL. They need, like, the lip uh, injections. Whatever crap they got nowadays. Nah, you don't need it. This is a Japanese game, right? So this is why we see normal, normal size. We see decent looking chicks. Because this is how normal are, you know, normal is. But in GTA 6, we see like big, I mean, I'm not complaining though. Like, wow, I'm not complaining because that's how it is uh, right now. And uh, especially in America and in North America, like every chick is trying to get BBLs and fake plastic surgery and crap like that. Lip injections. I mean, if you want to make a bigger, get! This is this is still get, bro. This is still get. You know what I mean? She worked for that. See what I'm saying? That's get. She worked for that. That's natural. That's that's to achieve that. There was some hard work that was poured in. But nowadays, I, I mean, the the Western women they just wanna get the easy way. They they wanna put in work. They just wanna get the BBLs, bro. Bruh. Just get get the BBL. Asian is the way to go, man. Damn. Look at that. God damn. Yo, I like that smile, though. I like that smile. I think my heart just took a screenshot right there. Yeah. Mm -mm. That's like the Western mentality. <laughs> I'm strong. I'm independent. I'm strong and independent. Damn, my guy looking like... <laughs> Yo, he looking like... I forgot that sucker's name, man. That's... Yeah, damn, son. I think I might be into Asian chicks too, guys. Sneeko! That Sneeko, bro! They got that Sneeko! Oh, oh, Yo, this guy looked like Sneeko, bro. Dang, they got Sneeko up in this too. Damn, yo, this game is like the, 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 the Sims version. The Minecraft Sim version. Recently, they had the Lego build. If I, uh, yeah, Lego build. I think that's what it's called in Fortnite. I've only played once, just not finding time. I, I've been playing like Black Ops 20. Uh, I want to play Black Ops 2024. Let's be real, but it's not out, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but I've been playing Black Ops Cold War, Nuketown 24/7, and been loving that. 
and a little bit of Fortnite on the side. I recently started. The no build in Fortnite is amazing. And on top, they got Lego build. Uh, they also got racing as well. Racing is very, very good in that. Uh, no build, I've only played. Uh, no build is very, very fun. Uh, Lego, I played a little bit, and it's actually pretty decent. It's pretty decent. I know there's uh, there's a market for it. Personally, I don't like customizing that much. You, you know, that's probably a L. Bruh. L take, L take or W take. I'm one of those guys that like, I just want to jump in, give me good story, give me good gameplay. I'm happy. I just want to play. Like, I, I don't want to, I don't like spending that much time on building characters. I, I would just give, like, give me the default character. I will just try to make him or make him look decent. With, with like two minutes and that's it there are seconds i spent hours on that personally i'm not into games where like you have to build like that damn she look good damn so damn so damn so yeah different time graphics good as well but i know there's like a huge market for people that love building stuff that so i i think this game will appeal to them you kind of got that weed music nah bro come on bro don't nah bro don't tell me you're gonna start playing like a like a baby infant and then you're gonna grow up in the game <laughs> Bruh. and then you're gonna be like you know what i'm saying like that would be insane that would be insanely immersion okay you know what i take it back i think that would be lit like imagine you playing like as a one day old baby and then you need to play with him till you get to the age of 18 and then 20 30 40 50 you know you play with a character as a character from like day one to like the last breath it's probably not like this but i just got the idea just by watching i mean i wouldn't even i think that idea is kind of dope actually yeah they they're trying to make like they're trying to make like those uh family type games right now bro <laughs> and japan is like the most uh lonely uh lonely country i, I believe so they i mean they work a holic bro they work like crazy and we got the Jurassic Park survival. That Mia Khalifa game, right? I think this is a Mia game. <laughs> bro, I need a filter, bro. I got no filter. I just say it like the way it is right now. I've been just letting it out, bro. I need a filter, bro. Yeah, this is like that Mia game. This is Dr. Maya Joshi. I've been left behind on Isla Nubla. Oh, damn. Yeah, like. I mean, I swear, like, she, uh, looking like Mia right there. I think it's the glasses that makes makes that appearance come to to life. You know what I'm saying? Came to mind. You know what I'm saying? Bruh. <laughs> but this game can be good. Game game can be good, but they haven't shown us much. Like this is CG, obviously. Damn. Cold storage. Is anyone there? Honey, I'm home. Yeah, what you looking at, huh? Yeah, Braga, Brad. What? What? Yo, my God. In order, I would like to say, "Ye to isne to pan thuk diya, ya? Isne to pan thuk diya? Good ka, good ka, kha ke thuk diya isne? Good ka, kha da? Good ka? Yeah." Yeah, that small chicken arm. And yeah, speaking of T-Rex though, did you guys know that chicken actually came from T-Rex? Oh shit! Oh, I know that sounds like very brain dead, but that's like what I heard. Like chicken came from T-Rex. It's like the evolution of the, the T-Rex. Yeah, I, I know it sounds kind of weird, but Google, I, I googled, uh, and that's what it says. Oh, okay, okay, not bad, not bad, not bad. Oh my god, oh my bad. Yeah. <laughs> this one is Paranormal Tills. Yeah, I accidentally clicked the wrong button there. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Now the lights are off. Oh my god. Bruh, 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 bruh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 
damn whole rev. Run! 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 Oh my god! Shit! Yeah, 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 yeah! Okay, I got scared right there, bro. Holy god, no. Man. It got that GoPro, like, fisheye camera to all rip. All rip. All rip. All rip. Okay, Paranormal Tales wish list. If you dare, don't play PT.com. Oh, hey. I would say this is by far one of the best game from the list. Yeah, alongside this as well. This, what's this called? Lost Fragment. Lost Fragment. What? I thought it was called something else. Man, this game looks insane. But I don't think it's gonna be uh, that big of a game. I don't think it's ever coming out, to be honest, if you ask. Because most of these projects are just... Just all showcases of the tech, but we don't get to really play. I could be wrong, and I hope I'm wrong, but... Because most of the projects are just like... Being made by one guy. And, and uh, they, they, put, they, they put all their time in making like the graphics be like crazy, ultra realistic. Like for example, this guy. Uh, this guy, I, I don't even remember who made it. Exa for example, this game, right? This game, not this guy. Like, bro. Yeah. Yay, this game looks just ultra realistic. It's like the body cam. But I don't think we're gonna get it. Or maybe he's gonna release this level. But even if they release it or that that that, that dev uh, release it, it's just that it's gonna be a super small game. Understandably, of Shots course. Fired. I'm Shots fired. Understandably, because obviously these are. Shots fired. Yeah, I'm trying to reduce the volume, dog. Because understandably, like he, they don't have the budget of like billions and billions of dollars. Like those billion, multi-billion dollar companies. So it's kind of understandable. I like not even complaining, but just trying to give you guys the real outlook on it. Because if you guys expect half of these games, I believe this, I can see this game coming out. But the other one, the last one, I, I don't know, man. Even if it comes out, it's just going to be like a super short game. And I don't know, man. But if it comes out, will it be free? Because if it's free, then I guess no complaints. If it's gonna be like, let's just say, like, 5 bucks, 10 bucks, 20 bucks, then that's fine too, right? That's justified. Because there was a game that came out recently, uh, that was, uh, I believe 5 bucks? And it sold more than Call of Duty? And it's only on Steam, I believe? I forgot the name, I forgot the name. And this is called Unrecord. What's the last game? I don't even wanna look at the name. I wanna keep it surprise. For myself, for myself as well, and for you guys. Do you guys uh, think that a game like that can be can be fun, or it's just good to look at it, Where the fuck is but not for like gameplay? Because there are games that look amazing, but gameplay-wise, they're boring as f. And I get that boring kind of vibe from it. I don't know. Yeah, this game, this game, this game, this game. Yeah, this is like that Konnichiwa game, bruh. Bumbo Cloud! Bumbo Cloud! Or Konnichiwa. I don't have a meme sound effect for Konnichiwa. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this game is looking crazy good. This is like that GTA 10. Japanese version with interactivity, you know? The guns, look at the reflection, though. Look at the muzzle flare ray tracing on that. Yeah, guns are looking amazing. No cap. We got Brutus out there. Yo, that got big. Yeah, man. I, I wonder, like, what he eats for dinner and lunch, bro. Like, he must get, like, 20 pounds of protein on a day. On a daily basis, though. And the mess seems kind of packed as well. Project M, yay. 
Guys, click on this video on the screen. This is the last episode that we've done on this. It's the entire series. Click on it. Check this out. On the left, though, we got PlayStation and Xbox fanboys having a meltdown. Check both of these videos out, and I will see you right there.